Hello everybody, it's uh, me, obviously, and um, I just want to make a quick, short video saying that, um, well, there's going to be changes for me because, the, you know, the dance I work at is closing February 24th or sooner, so I got to figure out if I want to transfer to a bigger store, which I really never wanted to work at a big store. It would just wouldn't be the same. I like I like all the people that I work with there. They're all such funny people and just it's. It, I mean, we get to have fun at this store. We get to visit with each other. You can't really do that at other places. Like this is is like a good first job for people, and it's closing. And all the old people that live around this area can't go to the bigger store. So it's gonna suck for everybody. And they're the company that owns it is greedy as fuck. They only care about we're not making the same money as the bigger stores so they're shutting us down because they don't care about us just because we don't make as much money or we're not making what they want so they're shutting us down and it's just stupid because I would have been there a while yet but I it's just hard to believe that they're closing down and they could sh close their doors in two days if they want you know they can do it whenever they want but the deadline is February 24th so I don't have much time to think about if I want to transfer to another store I actually still do work at Dollar Tree I got that arranged but I still need two jobs because Dollar Tree is set up for money to go into my savings account I need a job where I can have money going into my checkings account as well um, so I don't know I don't know what to do <laughs> it, it's just it's not gonna be the same I've worked there for three years almost already. And it's just, I've gotten to know everybody I work with. Everybody knows each other. You get to know all, all the customers after a while. It's just, and they're just shutting down a family store. You know, it's like, I don't like it. But, and the thing is, I don't drive yet because I'm just really uncomfortable driving. I'm not, I'm pretty paranoid when it comes to driving. I can't multitask on the road, the signs, everything. And so that's another problem. I have to have rides or, so it's hard to find a job that will schedule me hours that I can actually work. Like here, I'm at my dad's house. If I work like... If I work, I work at nine in the, nine a.m., so in like thirty minutes, I sleep over here and I walk to my dad's house. But if I work, and if I work like four to ten, and ten to four the next day, I just sleep over here and walk over. It's that easy. And well, they always schedule me like times when I can have when I actually have rides and who knows I mean this this job is just easy and it's I don't know it's always been fun and like I said all the people that I work with are really fun people I like you know we all get along very well together so it's like uh, it kind of sucks we just got notified yesterday too this just happened they just decided yesterday they sent all the managers and PIC, PICs, meaning person in charge, a notification, and they're just all shocked. Nobody, everybody's thinking about what to do because even the the store owner managers, they don't know what to do. There's no other job openings for their position, so they might have to move, go somewhere completely different to get that kind of a job. So they're really out of luck. See, right over there, his dance. <laughs> so. So no more working in the deli and all that stuff. I mean, I could at a different store, but yeah, a different store would be a nightmare as well. Because like this deli, like there's there's not that many customers that go back there. I mean, it's a lot of I mean, it's a lot of cleaning and work, but it's a lot of lull time too. So I don't know. Well, I guess we'll have to wait and see. But I am bummed out, and like I, so, like sometimes I'm just like, eh. But then other times it just hits me hard. Like, this place is going to be gone, like, in less than a month. And five years are going to pass, and we're going to look at this store being like, I can't believe that closed down that long ago already, you know, as time goes on. And the memories are just going to, like, haunt me of being in that place because it's going gonna, it's gonna to torture me because I'm going to miss working there just like I kind of miss school, you know, seeing everybody, talking to everybody. I don't necessarily care about the job that I do because I can do the same job anywhere, but it's just the people that I like. That's the problem. That's what, 
that's what I don't like. But I just wanted to make a video talking about it. But yeah, anyways, see you later.